yes to overnight oats. I'm sharing here six unique overnight oats recipes. Overnight oats make a perfect breakfast or lunch. Each of my overnight oat meals has a unique set of nutrients to get you through the day, keeping you happy, your stomach satisfied, and your body full of energy. We will make special yuki beetroot and plums overnight oats, tahini carob overnight delight, caramel apple overnight oats, morning carrot cake oatmeal, overnight basil ginger turmeric oatmeal booster, and tender banana pineapple overnight oats with the saffron touch. All overnight oats are sattvic and made of only positive pranic ingredients. Okay, let's go! First goes Yuki Beetroot Special Overnight Oats with plums, walnuts, and more wholesome stuff. In the morning, before you go about your business, soak some pecans with a splash of lemon and a pinch of salt. At night, let's get ready. For this overnight oats recipe, we will need one small beetroot, freshly squeezed lemon juice, dark raisins, freshly ground flax seeds, ripe plums, a couple of bajul dates, pecans or walnuts, and a pinch of Himalayan salt, or you can use a sea salt. And that serves too. To the blender, half a cup of chopped beets, two or three bajul dates, soaked and rinsed pecans, freshly squeezed lemon juice, salt, one cup of filtered water, and then blend until smooth and creamy. Now, in the bowl, combine old-fashioned rolled oats, flax seeds, and raisins with the beetroot mixture. Off it goes to the jar with chopped plums and homemade yogurt or pudding, and to the fridge overnight. Next morning, my microphone wasn't working, so here I'm telling you that I love to eat my overnight oats not from the jar, but from the bowl. Add some honey and roasted walnuts, and your overnight oats are ready to be enjoyed. These overnight oats can be kept in the fridge for up to four days. Next up, carob tahini overnight oats with basil seeds, figs, and bananas. Mm. For this recipe, we will need old-fashioned rolled oats, basil seeds, roasted carob powder, cinnamon, Himalayan salt, almond milk. You can see the way I make it in this video. tahini and carob syrup. I'm using homemade tahini. You can see the way I make it in this video. Make it yourself or use your favorite brand. Off to the fridge overnight. In the morning, I love to enjoy my overnight oats with banana and some figs. There are two ways to go about it. The first way is to caramelize figs and bananas. Second is to enjoy them raw. I don't know which is my favorite, so I'm gonna show you both ways. Bam. Okay, this is cooking. I ran out of my homemade yogurt this day, so I made a cashew vanilla pudding on a fly last night. That's what I'm having my overnight oats with this morning. You can use yogurt instead or check out this vanilla pudding recipe on the website. Nice! Now, this is absolutely optional, but 
utterly delicious topping. Melting, melting, melting. One, two. Heat it up. Roasted carrot. I'm just working this in. I'm sprinkling some puffed armoring for texture. Eat it with joy! If you use fresh milk, you can keep this oatmeal in the fridge for up to 4 days. This recipe makes 3 servings. Caramel apple overnight oats with banana, chia seeds, cinnamon and some more good stuff. For this recipe, we will need one sweet apple, banana, old-fashioned rolled oats, nutmeg, cashew milk or any other plant-based milk of your choice, cinnamon, chia seeds and dark raisins. And for the optional toppings, we might need walnuts, dates or peanut butter. The key to success for this recipe is in a sequence of events. While incorporating ingredients, it is essential to do it in this particular order. First, incorporate nutmeg and cinnamon with mashed banana. Then, add cashew milk. Then, incorporate chia seeds. Followed by oats. And only then, mix in apples and raisins. Off to the fridge for the night. In the morning, top your overnight oats with dates for caramel flavor. Roast some walnuts. Add decadence with peanut butter. I'm using homemade peanut butter. You can see me making it in this video. You can make it as well or use your favorite brand. Treat yourself. And now to the basil ginger turmeric booster. For this recipe, we will need old fashioned rolled oats, basil seeds, turmeric, ginger, cardamom, cashew milk or any other plant based milk, cinnamon, vanilla bean, honey, and it will make two portions. If you don't have fresh turmeric, you can use powdered one. Just use half of a teaspoon. Same applies to ginger. Grinding some cardamom, getting some vanilla from the bean, to a bowl, add old-fashioned rolled oats, salt, basil seeds, cinnamon and black pepper, here goes cashew milk, ginger and turmeric, vanilla and cardamom. into a jar and off to the fridge for the night. In the morning, sweeten your overnight oats with some honey and top it with caramelized bananas. After sweetening your oats with honey, top them with some yogurt. I am using my almond milk yogurt. You can see the way I make it in this video. Try it with pomegranate seeds and some buffed amaranth. 
Uzuva, Mariana, Naya, Uzuva. I love you very much. Now sit back and give yourself a boost. Good morning, carrot cake oats! In the morning, set one third of a cup of walnuts to soak. So, in the evening, we can start by making some walnut milk. In the blender, add soaked walnuts, three medjool dates, one and a half cups of filtered water, a pinch of salt, and don't forget a teaspoon of cinnamon. For this recipe, we will need one cup of loosely packed shredded carrots, four dry apricots, one cup of old-fashioned rolled oats, four tablespoons of freshly shredded coconut, or you can use two tablespoons of unsweetened coconut flakes instead, freshly ground flax seeds, raisins, and walnut milk that we just made. Combine well, transfer into a jar, and send to the fridge overnight. In the morning, enjoy your carrot cake delight with some homemade yogurt and roasted walnuts. You can add some pumpkin seeds as well. Feel good having this wholesome, healthy dessert as your breakfast. Now to easy, delicious and tender banana pineapple overnight oats with a saffron touch. Combine old-fashioned rolled oats, basil seeds, cashew milk and saffron. Place it in a jar and send it to the fridge overnight. In the morning, simmer one cup of fresh chopped pineapple and mashed banana. Sweeten your overnight oats with maple syrup and then top them with toasty pineapple banana mixture. I love mine with a sprinkle of cinnamon and some puffed amaranth for crunch. Enjoy this tender goodness with love. It's the easiest one, the quickest one, and now very gentle. It's very gentle. I like it when you don't cook it too much, so it's nice and warm but still pineapple have a, the crunch, you 